but Mel followed me back on her Finsta, guys, and I was like, ah, I'm so happy. Hey guys, it's me, Allison, and today we are doing a What's in My Backpack video. This is for my first semester of sophomore year. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, <clears throat> this is my backpack. It's really cool. It is by the North Face. I got it because Mel Joy had a similar one her sophomore year, so yeah. Um, I have two other What's in My Backpack videos on my channel for my freshman year. You guys can go watch them. I will hopefully link them down below. So yeah, let's get started. I have recorded this multiple times, but like, I've, I've deleted them for various reasons. So we're gonna do it again, okay? Today is September 14th, 2017. I don't know, this was, this was like six. But anyway, so this is my back- Oh my god, it's caught on my toe! Okay, <laughs> this is my backpack. I just got home from school, like, right away. I was like, let's go film! <laughs> So, yeah, this is my backpack. Um, this year I am taking Honors Humanities, or this semester I'm taking Honors Humanities, AP Calc, AB, and, oh, Color Guard. Uh, Color Guard and then an off roll where I can chill, do my homework. So, yeah, I was taking Chemistry 1 2 before, but I dropped that, so I would have time to do my homework before Color Guard practice and all that ish. So, yeah, so this is my backpack. It has two water bottle pockets, one on each side. So, in the one that's like, okay, when I'm wearing it, it's on my right, so that's where I keep my water bottle. Uh, ow, frick! It just scratched my leg. There's like a scrape there now. Okay. Um, so yeah. This is where I keep my water bottle. It's like really empty right now. I have, it's hot during Color Guard, okay? It's very, very hot. Ow, I scraped myself. So yeah, that's what's in that pocket. Oh my god, and there's trash. There's a straw wrapper. This looks like a Capri Sun straw wrapper. Oh, oh, this might be more trash now. I don't know. And then in the other water bottle pocket, I believe there's trash, yeah. We have, oh, we have a cookie wrapper, because I buy, okay, now that I off roll, I buy a lot of school cafeteria cookies, and I need to, like, stop. I buy a lot of, like, food now, because I'm like, oh, I'm hungry, so, yeah, during off roll, I eat a bunch now, so I'm spending more money, and I'm also eating more, so I need to, like, spend less. I can still eat as much, but, like, I need to spend less. Um, so, yeah, this is a cookie wrapper. This isn't even the one from today. This is one from a while ago. I don't know why. And, good, that's the only trash in there. Oh, no, 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 this hot drop wrapper. I haven't had a cost up since like last year, but okay. Um, okay, so moving on into my backpack, we're gonna start with the very smallest, the very smallest pouch, the smallest pouch. By the way, I have an essay tomorrow, and I should really work on it, but we'll see. Okay. Yeah. All right. So first thing I always keep in this pocket, or not always, if it's not in my back pocket or my hand, it's my phone. I keep it in that pocket. So this is my iPhone 6s with my Mickey Mouse case from Amazon. So, yeah, maybe one day I'll do a what's on my iPhone video, but who knows, because I need to figure out a way to record my screen. Next up, we have my earbuds. They are all tingly-wingly. I just kind of stuff them in there, honestly. Sometimes I roll them up nicely, most times I don't. I'm like, I gotta, I gotta go, you know? So, yeah, these are my earbuds. They're the ones that come with the iPhone. I love them. Actually, those were my mom. She gave them to me, but anyway. Then we have a school lanyard, so I can't show you guys because it's got my school name on it. But I have my bus pass. Uh, Kate Spade keychain, a Disneyland keychain, an A keychain, a uh, thing my grandpa gave me, my keys, my Panera card, and my bus pass. So I keep those all on my school lanyard so I can just grab it really fast when I need it and I have like everything I need on it. And then I have another lanyard. Yippee. This one holds my drill for Color Guard. We've done movements one and two of our show. We're performing movements one and two tomorrow at the football game and it's going to be scary. We haven't learned all our work yet, I don't think, but... We have done all the movements, and um, we have done some of the work. So I'm scared. It's really hard to like do your flag work and move at the same time. But I have the drill count memorized. I'm so proud of myself. I got it down like after yesterday. I had it down in my head for movements one and two. I have the count. So go me. Then we have my watch. I take it off and I put it on. Like you know, I keep it in there so I won't forget it. My watch is three minutes and like 56 seconds fast right now. I think it used to be a little bit slower. Oh my god, tomorrow's Friday. Yes, bless. I've been so tired, guys. Oh, my God. Um, we have a paper in here. I think it's my schedule. It's my old schedule. Because I got a new one once I dropped my class, so yeah. Oh, no, no, no. This is my new schedule. This is my new schedule, the one with the off-roll on it. So, yeah, I used that before I got the sticker. They give you a sticker so that um, you can put on your ID card so they know when you go off campus and stuff. So, yeah, I have a filling council right now, so I didn't need parent permission because we didn't know. But, anyway, um, we have a piece of paper. That was my pass to the library. Um, yesterday. I didn't know we were supposed to put them in a box they had in the library or like a bin thing. I didn't know we had to put our passes in there, so I kept this one. Uh, I put my my pass from today in there because uh, Honors Humanities, we're writing our essay on Macbeth and Antigone. Mac Macbeth, I said that's so weird. We're writing our essay on Macbeth and Antigone, so I don't bring a computer to school because I have a PC or I have like a desktop, so I'm not going to haul that to school. Um, so, um, 
the wind just rustled those blinds. So yeah, I was like, can I go to the library? Because my humanities teacher is the best. I love his class so much. He's an awesome teacher. I love him, love him, love him. Um, he's so chill. He's like, yeah, I don't care. So he just writes you a pass and you go to the library. So yeah, I can write there. Um, we have some receipts. I believe this is, oh, I thought this was going to be Subway. We have a pickup sticks receipt and we have a, another pickup sticks receipt. One or two. I guess they came together. Um, then we have, oh, I think this is my old schedule. Let me see. Yeah, this one's my old schedule with the chemistry on it. That chemistry. Then we have another receipt. I believe this one, oh, this is for Vons. I bought a balloon because my friend's birthday was the 12th. So, yeah. And then we have contacts. So in case I ever need, oh my god, oh, there they are. They're getting so messed up, but they're doing better than they were in the other pockets. So, yeah, hopefully these don't open or anything. So, yeah, we have my contacts because I wear dailies. So, yeah. I, I put them in my backpack because I thought with chemistry you're not allowed to wear contacts when we do experiments and stuff. But I dropped chemistry, so I don't really need to keep these. But you never know. Sometimes my left contact gets all funky wonky. That's not a phrase, but whatever. And so, yeah, maybe I'll need to replace it one day. So these are my right ones, and then these are my left ones because negative 2, negative 2.5. Yep, those are my contacts. Okay, guys, so moving on to my backpack, we are going to go into, let's see which pocket. I think this one. No, this one. We're going into this pocket. We're going to go into this pocket. So in this pocket, um, this one has like kind of fuzzy inside. So is the one I showed you before. They're fuzzy. We have hair ties. We have a pink one, a purple one, and recently I put in a red one too. Um, actually, I don't know where it is. It fell. Um, we'll find it. So yeah, uh, I had to put in. I put in the pink one again this morning, and then I put in added a red one so I could have more. We have bobby pins because I need to pin my hair down for like football games and stuff sometimes. So yeah, when we do color guard stuff. Oh, there's hair in this. So yeah, we have black and brown. Got some good old bobby pins in there. We have a makeup removing wipe. I don't know why it's all crinkly. We have my vanilla, our island vanilla perfume from Pacifica. Got out sprouts in like sixth grade. We have my EOS lip balm in Wildberry. We have my Tangle Teaser because my friend Riley had one and she let me use it last year and I was like, this is a blessing. So yeah, she let me use it last year after we swam one of our swim days. So yeah, and I was like, oh my god, they're amazing. So I bought one. Uh, or my dad bought it for me, I don't know. So yeah, I keep it in my backpack now. That's my brush. And where's the other hair tie at? Where you go, man? I totally put one in there. What's this? Another cough drop wrapper. I was sick last year, okay? Actually, I guess that was technically this year, but it's last school year. I'm pretty sure I put a new hair tie in here. Where are you at, though? I totally put one new, one new, one new, I can't talk. I totally put one in here this morning. I had the purple one. Oh yeah, sticky down here in the my backpack, by the way, because there were cough drops in there, and then it rained one day, and yeah, you know what happens to cough drops when they get wet. I don't know where that hair tie went, because like this morning, I knew I had the purple one in there, but the pink one was in my bathroom, and I also had a red one with the pink one, and I don't know where that thing's at now, man. So, yeah. Hopefully I'll find that one day, because that, that, was, that was a nice hair tie, you know? It wasn't stretched out or anything. It was all Gucci. So, yeah, hopefully we'll find that again. Hmm. So that's what I keep in that pocket. Next up on this side, we'll go into this pocket. I'm hungry. Uh, I'm also volunteering at my old elementary school tonight, and I'm so excited because I missed it. But at the same time, I also want to just sleep. So I'm like, why did I sign up to do this? I don't know. So we have a deck of cards! Hey, This wasn't in there at first this year, but I decided for my Honest Humanities project, we're doing a Google 20 project, I decided to study magic for it because I love magic and there's still so much I can learn about it, so brought back the old deck of cards. If you guys know, I used to bring this to school so I could do impromptu magic tricks and play card games with my friends, and then I stopped doing that, but now we're bringing it back. So yeah, this is one of uh, my cards from probably 2013. It says 2013 with a question mark. Every summer I get pretty much, uh, or pretty much every summer I'd get a new deck of cards from my magic class. So yeah. Um, then we have tape. This is a I, don't, I like to sniff it, I don't know why, but like it smells really like bad, so like I have to like smell it to remind myself. But it's electric- oh, 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 the smell hit me now. It smells really bad. It's electrical tape. Um, I use it to tape up my color guard flag. I haven't had to tape it in so long. Go me. Proud of me. Proud of myself. Um, you tape it because- I tape it because I drop it, and then- or well, I, when I drop it, the tape gets worn down, and if it gets worn down too far, your bolts could come out, come flying out. It's, hold on, I gotta fix this. Whoever used my tape last messed it up a little bit. Not really. I oh got pull, pull, pull. I don't want to get my scissors out. Oh my god, I'm messing this up. Ah, oh, jeez, I messed it up more. Go me. Okay. Well, at least it's not overlapping on the weird part. So, yeah, I have white electrical tape so I can tape up the ends of my flags so bolts don't fly everywhere and hit people. That would be really bad. 
Then we have a phone charger. This is attached to the cube right now. These are essential for high school living. I advised one of my color guard freshman friends. I was like, you need these to survive. I think it was a freshman. I don't remember. It was someone I told. I was like, you need that for high school. Because they were like, uh, their phone was getting low. So, yeah. Also, I have a portable one. This one, it currently has three dots because I used one of them at some point. I don't know. Then I have band-aids. We have Hello Kitty band-aids. Um, let's see what else we have. We have a normal band-aid. And another Hello Kitty band-aid. And that's it in this pocket. I tried to use, put less stuff, I guess, in these pockets so that it would look a little bit skinnier this year. But that didn't happen because it ends up I have a lot of color guard stuff in my backpack. So, yeah. Let's stuff all this ish back inside. <laughs> okay. Alright, moving on. We are going to go into the first slightly bigger pocket, which is this one right here. And I love this pocket because it has so many places for you to, like, organize your stuff. So, yeah. Basically, it looks like this. Oh, it looks like this. So, here's my pencil pouch. I'll show you guys what's in that in a sec. But, yeah, it looks like this. There's organization areas. And so, yeah. So, in my pencil pouch, this says I'm very busy on it. It's blue. It's really pretty. And it matches my planner this year. So, that's crazy. Um, so, we have my favorite kind of pens. I love these, except, okay, I really love the light blue. But this one has been clumpy. So, that's making me sad. And I love the purple. These are like my favorite pens, and I had them in 7th grade, and I finally have them again. We have two highlighters. We have a pink pen. This was a different brand. Uh, we have lead. 0.7, I believe. Yep, 0.7 Pentel lead. We had a bunch from, like, my brother. Uh, we have my naked eraser. Naked. It doesn't have its jacket on. This is my favorite pencil last year, and I'm using it again now. But for a while, my favorite pencil this year was my pink one. I should put my other two mechanical pencils in here, because honestly, I don't use them because they're down in my backpack. Um, I'll show you guys where they were, uh, where they are right now, okay. and then later I'll put them in my pencil pouch. Anyway, pink highlighter, orange highlighter, black pen, blue pen, green pen of a different brand, red pen of a different brand, different brand, orange pen of that other brand. So yeah, of the same-ish brand. I don't know, man. Okay. So yeah, that is what's in my pencil pouch. By the way, it's gold inside. Wow, who knew? I never really look at that, so whoa! Wow, wow, wow! I'm just very impressed. It looks really pretty. Doing these videos is a great way for me to see what's in my backpack as well. And like, organize a little bit. Yeah, no, I'm pretty organized though. I know where stuff is. So yeah. Okay, moving on in this pouch. So we have the zippered pocket here. I'll show you guys what is in there. So in the zipper pocket, we have the most important one in here is my wallet. This is very, very important. I take this out like every day. Um, because I keep buying food and I need to stop and I also need to empty this because there's a bunch of coins in it. But yeah, I guess I could spend the coins. It's a Kate Spade wallet. I got it for my 15th birthday. I'm so hyped for my 16th birthday and it's in April, but I'm hyped already. I'm also hyped for homecoming. It's in exactly a month. So hype, hype, hype. Anyway, my wallet has my ID card, my Zoom membership card, money, 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 debit card, receipts, like, yeah, 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 yeah. Da, 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 and other cards and stuff. So yeah, very important because I need my ID card for my off roll. So if I want to like go to the library or leave campus. Um, then in the zipper pouch, we also have Tic Tacs, so these are the rainbow ones. So yeah, I keep them in case, you know, you ever need to freshen your breath, you know? Then I have a bunch of, like, the eraser replacements for, like, my mechanical pencils. Those, by the way, are my favorite mechanical pencils in the world, so here's another one. They're the best mechanical pencils, my fave, they're the Paper Mate. Uh, I use the .7, I use .5 sometimes, too. Here's another eraser. There, I have a lot of the eraser fillers. And then we have lead... 0.7. This is the one that came with the pencil. Oh, here's another eraser. They have a, I have a lot of the replacement erasers. Oh, I should really replace some of mine because I'm pretty sure they need to be. Some of them do. Alright, so that is what is in that po- Oh, frick, what a drop. That is what is in that pocket. So yeah, making more use of that pocket this year. Um, because last year I had stuff in it that I never, like, needed, so yeah. Okay, so in the biggest, like, thingy here, we have my scissors, which just came out of their holder. They have a holder in here. Because I took sewing class two years, and both years we made a case for our sewing scissors, and since I only had one pair of sewing scissors, I used this case for my normal scissors. But it's coming off, so I have to, like, tighten it. But anyway, yeah, I like it. Make sure I don't hurt myself by accident. Uh, we have tape in here. Finally using my tape again for a um, DIY lamination of my drill for Color Guard. Um, so yeah, I really always needed tape in 8th grade, and I never had it. And then in ninth grade, I brought it, and then I didn't need it. So yeah, now it's 10th grade, and I kind of need it. Then we have post-its, and that's all that's in that pocket right there. Um, moving on, we have 
Over here we have a pencil, a number two pencil. It's kind of dull and dirty, but whatever. I don't really use that one. It's just, you never know. Glue stick. Then we have two more of my favorite mechanical pencils, which I'm now going to put in my pencil pouch because I never use them because they're there. Um, and then over here in the next, like, compartment -y thing, there's my calculator. This is the Texas TI-30X. 2S, I believe, but I am going to need a graphing calculator because I am a Calc AB, AP, AP Calc AB, so I'm going to need a graphing calculator um, halfway through the year. Um, then we have a, oh, by the way, my school is, like, accelerated, so, like, we kind of squish a, a year-long class into, like, half a year, I think. I don't know. I think that's what they said. I don't really know how it works. And then in this pocket, I have pads and tampons because that's where Mel Joy kept hers, too. So, yeah. By the way, oh, my God, Mel followed me back on her Finsta, guys, and I, like, I'm so happy. And she replied to my Insta comment on her main yesterday, and I'm just like, I am, I am living the dream. Queen is noticing me. So, yeah, that is all that is in that pocket. Um, hopefully this video won't be too, too long. I'm sorry if it is. We'll see. Moving on. Next pocket. It's the biggest pocket in here. This is where I keep a lot of random stuff, so we'll see what goes on. Oh, by the way, there's clips on the side to make it skinnier, but I'm going to unclip them because it's making it difficult to unzip it right now. My back is, like, showing because this is a very cropped hoodie. Uh, I love it, but it's very, very cropped. So, this is my first time wearing it to school today. So, we have clothes, first thing. Okay, they don't smell horrible. Um, these are clothes. Oh, they smell like apples because I eat apples. Like, I bring apples to school every day, so. Like, every day. I'm sniffing them. Just to make sure. Okay, so these are the clothes I wear to Color Guard class and also to our after school practices. I change it out every once in a while. We need white shirt, black bottoms for now. Um, later on we're gonna need black shirt, black bottoms. Black top, black bottoms. So we have, these shorts are amazing and H&M doesn't sell them anymore and I'm very, very sad about that because they're the dolphin shorts, but they have a pocket and I love that and I love them so much, but H&M, I can't find them there anymore and it makes me sad. Um, then we have um, my show shirt for this year. There's a bunch of fuzz on it because I put this hoodie in my backpack, so I guess I got fuzz on stuff in there, I don't know. So this is our show shirt. I'm not really going to show you guys because, yeah. But it's really pretty. Um, so yeah. You can see like a shadow, I guess. that It's inside out right now. Um, yeah, because, okay, everyone else in Color Guard has a locker. I didn't get one. But my friend said I can use her second band locker. So yeah, because, um, that, but I haven't done it so far. Honestly, it's easier for me. Now I'm used to just bringing stuff back and forth. We have the bag that my goldfish ran. I bring goldfish to school. <coughs> that did not smell good. Well, I mean, it smells good because it's goldfish, but it's like powdery. Anyway, I bring goldfish to school every day. Here's the remains of my sandwich. I don't eat crust, so that's what's in there. Um, so yeah, I bring goldfish to school every day. If you guys know me, you know it's true. We have a hat. Uh, I used to bring my UCLA hat for color guard practice, but now I've been bringing this hat, but now I also don't wear my hat. So yeah, I like stopped wearing it when I switched hats. I wore this like one day, and then I like stopped wearing my hat. Um, but anyway, it's the pink breast cancer awareness hat I have, because I was in the club last year. So yeah, I got one. Uh, we have my jazz shoes, because tomorrow we need our jazz shoes for the football game. Um, so yeah, I put them in here so I wouldn't forget. Um, but I also have to put in, like, my travel polo and leggings. So yeah, gotta do that later. But yeah, these are my black jazz shoes. I got them in 7th grade. They're in a size 8.5. Okay, good. Because they keep saying on color guard, they're like, get one size up. Oh wait, I am an 8.5. Frick. Well, these fit me, so I think I'll be fine, hopefully. Um, down here, oh my god, are these goldfish? Oh my god, I didn't know these were in here! I have more goldfish. This is from a different day, I guess. They're getting crushed. A little stale. Okay. I'm really hungry, I'm gonna eat after this video. So we have my Josh's. Then we have books. Um, we have Macbeth. We have... Three Sophocles, 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 Sophocles plays. Antigone's in there because we read Antigone. Then we have Elemental P. I actually really like it. It's pretty interesting. Uh, or, well, not pretty. Well, it's like, it's actually a really good book, I think. I like it. I like that it's written in letters. Like, in the form of, like, letters to people. Because that means certain pages are really, really short. And I love that. And it's, there's so many big words in this book. But that means I'm learning big words. So, yeah. And I'm reading this for our extra credit book talk. So yeah, we get to choose what book to read. When he explained the the plot of this one, I was like, OMG, that sounds so interesting. So basically, people in this book are living on an island where they worship the dude who made the sentence, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Some of my friends didn't know what that sentence was. So if you guys don't know what that sentence is, basically it's a sentence that uses every letter of the alphabet, and it's, it's very short, too. So yeah. 
And they worship the guy who made that on this island. But then, so they have a statue of him, and the sentence written below the statue are like tile on tiles. And then one day, one of the tiles falls off. It had the letter Q on it. So then they're all like, "Dude, we can't use the letter Q anymore. It's a sign." So they like. So then the author also tries to stop using the letter Q. I guess that's how my teacher explained it. Although he kind of still did a little. I know. I guess he stopped using it pretty much now. It's just. Because the characters in this are kind of against that. They don't believe in that as much. They're like, dude, the glue from the tile is just like, you know, dried. But, yeah. So, sometimes they rebel a little bit and use the letters. Um, but yeah, then other letters start falling off and they're like, bro, we can't use those other either. And it's like, if you like, use them, then you like, you have like, three strikes and then you're sent off the island and stuff. There's like, you just basically, go read the book guys. It's actually pretty good. I like it. So yeah. Good read. Then we have my glasses. Oh my god, they're covered in goldfish powder. Go me. Good job, me. I guess goldfish spilled in here. Oh my god, there's another bag. Oh my god, I have pretzels. Whoops. This is really good. This is why I wanted to go through this. I need to, like, vacuum inside my backpack. But anyway, that's what's in there right now. Oh my god, I left my eraser on my leg. I'll put that back later. Um, good thing I did this. I knew I was gonna have, like, random food bags in there. I knew it. Like, honestly, it is like a cavern in my backpack. So I'm going to put all these back, and I also need to put my polo and leggings in there, too. But, good. Good, good, good. This is helping me organize. Last pocket! This is where I keep more academic stuff, I guess. Oh, well, actually, that was some academic stuff. Alright. Give me. So, give me. <laughs> Basically, there's a laptop sleeve, and then there's a non-laptop sleeve part of this pouch. This is the where I put, like, my notebooks and stuff because I find it easiest because it's closest to me when I have my backpack leaning on my desk. So, desk, I guess, chair, I don't know. So, in the laptop sleeve, I keep this, and I love it so much. It is my planner. Um, my dad helped me decide which one to get. It is from Target, and I love it because the places for each day are big. Um, although I do like the ones where people have a day is one page. That's cool, too. I kind of want to get one of those one day. But yeah, I'm so excited. I love planning. Like, I started planning my 16th birthday party, which you guys know is in April, so yeah. I'm hyped. I get hyped, and I like to plan. So this is my planner. It's so, so pretty, and it matches my pencil pouch, coincidentally. So yeah, basically it's got all the months, and then you can flip in, and then they've got the weeks. So here was August. So yeah, there's August. I also write down my YouTube stuff. Here's September. Do you remember? Da -da -da -da. September. So, yas. Here was last week, I guess. I'll show you guys a little bit. Um, here's this week. Woohoo! I'm trying to keep it really organized, and I'm really proud of myself. I'm doing well. So, yeah. That's what's going down. I write down my homework, and I have, like, a key. I have, like, a code. You know, not a key. Well, and also, I auditioned for my talent show at school on Monday, so I'm really excited. I hope I get in, and I hope I win, because it's for a prize. Um, I think. So yeah, this is what's going down in my thing. Oh, look in here it says, film what's in my backpack. So yeah, that's my planner. Love it, love it, love it. I've written so much stuff in it. And yeah, it helps me stay organized. I like planning. Also, okay, so now in the non- Ow, frick. I cut my nails too short. Um, anyway, now in the non-laptop sleep part. I'm sorry, this video is really long. <laughs> um, not in the non-laptop sleep part, we have my binder. I am, like, known in my friend group for doing this. Every year, I make a binder cover with pictures of my friends and things I like. So, yeah. And then there's my name. It's in the font Waltograph. If you were wondering, I downloaded and installed it on my computer. So, basically, down here, we have all my friends. Here's Bethany Moda, Red, Cupquake, Cupquake, and Red. So, the times I met them. So, because I met Cupquake and Red twice. Um, then we have stuff I love. We have, like, Care Bears and Sims and My Little Pony and Minecraft and... Harry Potter, Hufflepuff, represent, woo! Um, then we have my Disneyland corner, like my Disney shrine, I guess. Pictures from various Disneyland trips, Lord of the Rings, Falls of Fury, Madagascar, Ping Pong Player, Supernatural, Sherlock, Grey's Anatomy, How Much Mother, Orange is the New Black, 30 Rock, Good Luck Charlie, Lost, then YouTube, we got Lisa Fan, Mitty Mox, Ayaz Cupcake, Liza Koshi, Mel Joy, Adeline Morin, Superwoman, and Ariana Grande, and then the rest is pictures of family and friends. So yeah, that's my binder cover. Honestly, the only thing I really keep in here is, like, Honest Humanity stuff, and then handouts that I couldn't, like, that weren't, like, I don't know, like, up in somewhere. So I have to apply for this, for California Scholarship Federation, so I have that stuff in here. Um, so yeah, and also I have, I passed my rewrite number two, which means I tried three times to write a paper, and I finally passed, so go me. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. 
Uh, I thought I was gonna pass the second rewrite, but uh, I mean the first rewrite, but no, I didn't. It's okay, I passed now. So yeah, it was, it was cause like the very first time we wrote, we had like no clue what we were doing. They were just like, here, write. So yeah. So we have papers and stuff in here, basically. Yeah, that's it. Mostly humanity stuff and then random paper. So yeah. That's that. And then the two notebooks I have in here are both for AP Calc. My AP Calc teacher likes us to do our homework in a separate notebook. So it keeps things organized. So like you can look at your notes while you do your homework. Also when he checks our homework on Fridays, he can just flip through it really fast. Um, so here's my Calc notes and here's my Calc homework. So I'm very, very proud. I love this color. So I was like, I'm going to give it to my favorite subject, math. Although AP Calc has been really hard. But I was like, I'll give it to my favorite subject, math. And then I used a dark blue for chemistry because I wasn't quite as into that shade. But then, you know, I dropped chemistry. <laughs> I love the purple one. I was like, should I use the purple for chemistry? I was like, nah, fam. We're going to save that for another class. Something that I like a little bit more, you feel? And then I found out we needed two notebooks for calc. So I was like, perfect. I will give this to calc. So, yeah. I'm trying to write a little bit neater, I guess. I don't know. It, it's full of math. I use a lot of paper for calc. Oh, my God. Every night I use, like, so many different sides. And, like, every day in class. I use a lot of paper. So I can, like, get my work done. I need to keep things organized, okay? I can't squish it all in there. So, yeah, that's basically all that is in my backpack. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing day.